Subtropical Storm Ana has kicked off the 2021 hurricane season a little bit early than the official start. It is located at 34.4 degrees north and 62.8 degrees west. Subtropical Storm Ana currently has maximum sustained winds of 50 miles per hour and a minimum central pressure of 1,003 millibars. It is currently moving to the west-southwest at about 3 miles per hour. There is no current CDPS stage rating as it is not expected to make landfall. Looking at the latest wind field, maximum winds extend outward up to 180 nautical miles to the northeast and 150 nautical miles to the northwest. Currently, Ana is located about 180 miles uh, to the northeast of Bermuda, that is 290 kilometers. There is a tropical storm watch in effect for the island as tropical storm force gusts are possible. The latest maximum sustained winds again are at 50 miles per hour. The National Hurricane Center and the ADT estimation is running just below our estimation at 45 miles per hour. We are at 50 miles per hour in concurrence with the HTP estimation. Here is the latest forecast for Ana. It is expected to slowly turn to the northwest this afternoon, and it is expected to zoom off to the northeast uh, tonight, and it is expected to uh, become an extratropical cyclone in about two and a half days before becoming absorbed pretty quickly afterward. Sea surface temperatures are rather cool for tropical development, however, uh, atmospheric conditions um, are supporting convective, convective development, which allows for a subtropical cyclone over these cooler waters. Looking at the latest rainfall totals, generally under one inch is expected along the path. Um, some areas could receive up to an inch of rainfall uh, to the north that's over water, actually. Uh, Bermuda looks to be generally under one inch. If a heavy band of rain happens to move over Bermuda, though, those rain totals could meet one inch. Latest wind. It is a swath of wind is again expected to remain mainly offshore of Bermuda. Uh, winds of over 34 knots are expected. However, a tropical storm watch does remain in effect for Bermuda as tropical storm force gusts are possible for the island this afternoon into tonight. Latest multi-model diagnostics comparison. The intensity forecast is pretty much in good agreement. It is expected to gradually weaken into a weak subtropical storm with winds of about 35 to 40 knots in the next 12 to 24 hours. Currently, deep layer shear is decreasing just a little bit, which will allow for the storm to remain around for a couple of days before becoming extratropical as deep shear skyrockets. The track forecast is in pretty good agreement as it will make that turn to the northwest this afternoon and then turn to the northeast tonight and into tomorrow. Sea surface temperatures, again, are rather cool for tropical development and the mid-level relative humidity does remain dry, drier than normal for uh, tropical development. Here are some of the latest satellite loops. This is visible imagery. It indicates that a possible eye-like feature is developing with bands of convection away from the center. Infrared loop does support this idea as well. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for the latest updates from Force 13 and the National Hurricane Center.